For months, northern Minnesota entrepreneurs have been competing for an award that helps fund their business ideas. And tonight, they were recognized. Our Brenda Mack has more. Twelve years ago, my daughter was playing hockey. I racked my brain out how to help her understand getting out of the net and covering the angles. And I came up with a very crude oh, tool, four lines going to the corners of the net on a doll rod. And it really helped her understand the concept. Eric is just one out of many entrepreneurs that has his idea grown and developed into a product. And tonight, he's able to share it with a ballroom filled with innovators. I'm, I'm loving every minute of it, getting to show this to, to people. Awesome. He is one out of three winners of the 8th Annual Idea Competition. The competition supports entrepreneurs with funds to help turn their ideas into fast-growing businesses. It's, it's kind of all done in an economic development spirit. So it's, it's, it's about growing and helping the region in, in, in whatever, you know, finding those innovators and those entrepreneurs and, and bringing them forward and helping them, helping them grow. This year, a Bemidji businessman is also inducted into the Idea Hall of Fame. It, it was really an honor for me. Um, our company's been in business this year for 75 years, so it's kind of a milestone. He says his background and family support is key to his success today. My parents are very, very uh, cooperative and helpful and very encouraging for me to take risks and to seek opportunities. So I've, I've had a really interesting career, but I feel very fortunate. For Eric, it is mentorship. This competition also provides training and business coaching to guide participants. The advisors that they put me in contact with, they, they did a lot to legitimize and make me believe that I was on the right track. This competition is not only a platform for innovators to share their ideas, but also one that inspires aspiring entrepreneurs. I love being able to actually meet local entrepreneurs. It's really inspiring for someone like myself. For us being students of business at BSU, we get to learn a lot because obviously we think about being future entrepreneurs as well. Work as hard as you can, be diligent, never give up, uh, be honest, and try to create opportunities for your fellow associates and employees, and that's a pretty good feeling. Other winners of this year's event are Air Corps Aviation and Far North Spirits. In Bemidji, Brenna Mack, Lakeland News. Local business Far North Spirits will also be moving into the semifinal round of the statewide Minnesota Cup. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.